Hey everybody! That was loud. I am SimSweety and welcome to part 28 of Pause for Dramatic Effect. Let's play The Sims 3 Generations. Yes. So I'm picking up right where we left off. I actually went in and decorated Lana's room. It's not that great because we don't have like a super big budget or whatever. But I just went with this little, little cute theme. Pink with this pattern that I love. And I put up a little picture that says, She is clothed with strength and dignity. She laughs without fear of the future. Which I think is very cute. And yes, yeah, so I actually wanted to pick up because Juliet is coming to scold Channing for skipping school. Oh, Channing. Yes, okay, so he's not grounded, he's just in trouble, so I think I want to actually have him go inside and maybe do some chores because he got in trouble and I think that would be a good idea to do. But is everything clean for once? I swear. Um... Go make a bed. Make this bed. I'm just trying to find some things that are dirtier that he can fix. See, why can't... Oh, is there already a trap? Oh, okay, that, that already has traps. Oops. It's already trapped. Everything is clean the one time. The one time I want my sim to clean something. It's already clean. Okay, well, we're just going to have... Oh, let's just, just do laundry. That's fine. I don't know why I said that so loud. That's fine. Do the laundry. Do the laundry. Oh, she wants to get married. She's ready to be tied down. What are you doing, Marius? Get out of the room, please. Thank you. Um, are you doing anything? Don't, uh, somebody who we didn't know died. Okay, that's cool. Let's serve up some... Let's just, I don't know. Spaghetti... I don't know why I say it's like spaghetti. Spaghetti for the family. Tucker is really... Or isn't your Tucker, right? Yeah, Tucker is really... Oh, you're not going to stop being friends with your mother. Anyway, Tucker's really starting to smell, so I'm going to have him... Oh, Maya's husband died. That's so sad. That's sad. Oh, I forgot we have children here. A little hungry. Who wants to help out? You are doing that. You're showering. Chris. Oh, you all have things to do. Great. Because you can't feed anyone. On the oh, you can. Cool. Is that the mom that I have? Or have children been able to feed on the floor? Uh, oh, no. They're going to be late to pick the kids up. Great. Now we're going to have extra time to take care of the kids. Yay. Here's Lana. We didn't get, like, a close-up look of her before. Whoops. I turned on caps lock and so zooming in. I mean, she's about as cute as all the babies are. She, they don't have, like, a different look to them. I think we'll age her up tomorrow just because it's going to be spooky day. And actually, I want you to finish eating that. Why aren't we romantic with Deng? I don't understand that. Come on. Almost done? Well, let's invite him over anyway. And we'll have them stay the night. Oh, we were taking care of one of their kids. We were? I didn't... Who were we taking care of? Sama? Oh, okay. We're taking care of one of geek to games kids. geek to games will not stop having children. In this game, of course. Obviously. Let's call Tamil the family. I don't know who's hungry. Because you aren't. You actually aren't. You are. Um, you aren't. You are, you are, and you are. Okay, cool, so we'll have them do that. You want to get A's? Maybe we will do that. I don't know. Oh, she wanted to take a, she wanted to. Okay, take a photo of Lana. I think we'll probably do that. That's pretty cute. Yay, they, it sounds like they're leaving. Chantel's parents weren't that late then. Will you get out of the way, woman? Okay, thank you. Okay, so off camera, I'm just gonna drag up their relationship because for some reason it like got reset and I don't understand why. And then I'll pick up in the morning. Yay. Good morning everybody and happy spooky day. It's pretty early in the morning. It's only like 7.30 right now and I have decided on what I want to do. But first things first, we got paid a little bit extra because we kept Chantel like 
five minutes later. I don't even know why. We barely even kept her later. And also, I wanted to say that a lot of these Sims actually have Twitters. And I'll link them all down below. Um, off the top of my head, I know Juliet has one, Willow has one, Maris has one, Channing has one, and Tucker has one. I think that's everybody. And if you want to make a Twitter for one of the Sims, then just make one and tweet to me, and I will follow you and put it in the description of these videos. So, that is pretty cool. But, yeah, I'm just sending all the kids out here in the front to play in this pile of leaves, because I think that is pretty cool. You are not going to come play in the leaves because you're a teenager, and I... Nope, that's not what I did. That That is not what I did. Nope, calm yourself. So, Dang is just sleeping over, I think. Yeah, he's swimming in the pool back there now. Of course he is. I'm gonna have Tucker... Actually, no, you're not gonna use it. You use this. I am going to have... Why are you questioning him like a little freak? Use there. Oh, did I already tell you to go in there? Okay, then I guess you can't use that bathroom. Use the downstairs one then. Okay, we got it all sorted out. But I'm gonna have Chris go in and use the booby-trapped toilet. So this cannot end well. It can't. You working on your homework together, boys? Okay. Oh, wait. Oh, here we go. And it's squirted. Ew. We got Lana's imaginary friend. So, yeah, he's all wet now, but whatever. Oh, something broke. Go, oh, well, who's eating? Oh, that's you. Well, whatever. I mean, we were gonna serve up pumpkin pie, but I guess if you want to eat that, my toe. By the way, that was my toe scraping against my desk. It wasn't anything else. Don't, don't get disgusting. Nobody else can eat right now. Are you gonna go eat? Whatever, share a secret with your brother. I don't, nope. Get over here. Go watch some TV. And you, I want you to actually throw a party. I want Willow to, I like, just, oh my goodness. But anyway, I want Willow to throw a feast party so the adults will stay at home, and of course Lana too, will stay at home and the kids can go out and trick or treat. So we're going to do a... Feast party, and it's going to start at 5 p.m. Formal attire, because this is going to be a fancy thing. We'll invite Maya, Gina, Lindsay, and Selena. And we'll invite Sebastian, because we're his cut worker. And we'll invite Jessica, because Chris knows her. I don't know why, actually is okay Landon aged up so we'll invite him and I think that's everybody oh and of course Dan I think that's everybody yeah uncomfortable okay who I want to invite so I don't want too many people to come but just a few and yeah I was like did I mention it's spooky day okay good our boyfriend or our future boyfriend is flirting with uh, our mother. That's creepy. That is creepy. Creepy, I tell you. Oh, what are you doing? Pardon? No. Pardon? Does this new one sound right? Pardon? Let's open this, get out our pie, and call everyone to eat. Or just, no, actually that, call to meal everyone. So everybody should come and grab some. Right? Y'all should be doing it. Um, get out of the shower. Yep, that's good. Get some. It's dang! Oh, okay, that was interesting, dang. Dang. So good looking. Grab a plate. Y'all get hungry enough and go back and grab a plate. Looks kind of like an orange. Oh, an orange from that angle. They're all gonna come and eat. Like the lovely family. Did something break? What is seeping water? Honestly, I don't know. Go ahead and clean the house. Oh, you wanted to have some baked angel food cake. I see, Willow. You're too good for none of that pumpkin pie. Um, we're not going to your party, Maya. I'm sorry. Nope. 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 
No, we're not going to your party, Amaya. Gosh. Will you eat that stupid baked angel food cake for heaven's sake? Ah. <sighs> eat it. You can fit. Gosh darn it. Yes, thank you. Thank you. Thank you for sitting and eating your dang food, Willow. But I actually want you to socialize with the dung really fast. And I want her to friendly introduction, because, you know, she's like, my, this is my daughter's, what are you doing? Stop that. Why are you cooing over children? Stop being a little freak and go watch TV. Whose phone is that? Willow, or not Willow. Juliet, shut your phone up, woman. Ignore call. Oh, that was just for Maya's party, which we ain't going to. So, I want her to get to know him a little bit. Let's coo over children, because that's something she would do. Let's talk about her family, you know, because what else does she talk about? I don't know. And I want her to ask about his alma mater. I feel like that would be something that she'd be like, Oh, where did you go to school? And... Go ahead and talk about the rain. You know, just typical mother. Why do you want to find out his sign? I don't know whether I should feel like that's going to be flirty or not. I think, yeah, you need to go use the bathroom. You have some needs to take care of. You need to go take a shower. And I think everybody else is pretty much okay. You could actually probably go take a bath or go on a submarine adventure. Either way, I don't really care. And the baby's mood is getting pretty low, so... Oops, not in rest. Let's go snuggle, play with, snuggle, play with, put down our child. Oh my gosh, stop that. Put down the child, put her down, put Lana in the crib, clean up. Why do they all, like, flock to the child when somebody is unhappy? You want to go trick-or-treating? You will. You will, in a little bit. Too bad it's raining, like pouring down rain. That kind of stinks. Yep, you just picked up your child. Or not your child, the child. You were paid for time off, or yeah, for time off. I was like, did it say time off? It did. And she gets this moodlet from the Angel Food Cake. Warm fuzzies. I love that moodlet. I really, really do. That's probably my favorite moodlet, like, out of the whole game. Oh, did you offend him? Oh, gosh. Gosh. Apologize. Hmm. So I really just want to see something. Like, I want to see if it does say this. Yes, it's her granddaughter. That is so cute. Julia is a grandma. And she's looking pretty damn good, if I do say so myself. But I think I want to age up Chris today. No, he doesn't. Oh, he... No. Oh. Yeah, we'll age him up today. So we'll age up Julia and Chris today, even though they technically don't age up for two more days, but I think it would be fun, you know, at the feast party to eat and then age everybody up. I think that would be kind of cute, you know? You feel? You want to go trick-or-treating? Do you guys want to go? Yes, you do. Trick-or-treating, and you will, so don't panic. All the boys are all sitting around the TV having some fun. We know you just got the whole family here. Don't socialize. Stop trying. I want you... Let's take a romantic photo together. That's cute, isn't it? It seems cute. Oh, he has to pee really bad. Go here. Get out of the way, lady. Clean the house. I feel like that's all she does now. It's just clean house. Yay, we got a romantic photo! Why is that the only... Oh, he has to pee. I know he does. But, um, why is... Oh, gosh. Um... No, don't go home. Aren't you going to come back? Are you going to come back for our party? I never did show you guys his, like, appearance. I can't really show it to you now that he's, like, running down a hill, but his hair is custom content. His top, I believe it's from some shoe store. Pants, I think they're just, like, probably deal. I don't know where his pants are from. I gave him a makeover a while ago. And shoes are custom content, I believe. He is pretty good looking, if I do say so myself. 
I know you can't get over there. It's because there's a darn couch in the way. Huh. I don't know what that noise was. You need to take care of your baby again, Willow. You had this child. You're taking care of it. Sorry. Give bottle. Play with a little bit. Do a snuggle. Yay. Our feast party is starting soon. Willow was paid for her time off. I guess that's good. Chat with Danny. Did he just call us? You literally just left. Like, don't be desperate. He's still here. I don't know. Did he go back to China? Uh, okay. My, yeah, he went back to China. We'll have to invite him over to visit soon. And so he can move in and we can get married. Because she wants to get married now. Oops, that was my toe on my computer. Like, just... I'm- oh my gosh, this thing is broken. I didn't even, like, know that. Call their pair technician, because ain't nobody got time to fix that. Please. I think you need to change Lana's dirty diaper, probably. I think that's what's wrong with her. What do you think you're doing on our laptop? <sighs> gosh. Let's just browse the web, whatever. It won't hurt you. And I changed the calendar to October, because, you know, it's spooky day. Actually, it's time to send the kids out to go trick-or-treating. Maris, what do I want you to dress up as? Change into costume. I want you... Since you're going to be your tom... I think I want... What I want Maris to be is I want her to be a little bit of a tomboy when she's younger. That was Twitter. But then when she grows up, I want her to get a little bit more girlier, but rebellious. So, whoops. Bunny is not what I want you to be. Change into costume. So I want her to do, I would say, a pirate. Because I think that's just girly enough. But not, like, too girly. But I don't know. I have never seen that costume. So, Chan or Channing. Bryce, what are your traits? Neurotic and a slob. He's a little bit crazier. So I want him to be a Dillbird. Jace. Um, he's, he's gonna be, you know, he's kind of, like, lazy, but he's brave, and he's not the smartest guy in the world, so I would say let's have him be Llama Boy, and where are you? Here you are. Channing, he's a good-looking, really rebellious one. He's, like, not even into trick-or-treating, but, you know, his brothers convinced him to, so he's going to be a rock star. And lastly, we have Tucker, who is the sporty guy, and I want him to be a, let's see here, I don't even know. Let's have him be a diver, whatever, that's fine. So now we just all gotta wait till they change. Oh, and Dang broke our computer, like seriously? Ugh. Yay, we got you in your costume. Why didn't you change your costume? What did I have you be? I wanted you to be a pirate. Yeah, change your pirate outfit. Come on. Oh, there we go. That is so cute. That is perfect. I love that. Oh, why didn't you change either? You're going to be a Dilbert. And did you change? Yes, you did. Oh my gosh. Wait, are you Dilbert? You're Dilbert. You're, you're going to be... I actually, I want you to be, um, let's have you be a sparse and alien, because that sounds pleasing. I don't know. I don't know. Are you? <gasps> He's a rock star. Oh my god, that's so funny. That is hilarious. And that's for you. Yes, you are a diver. So, let's start the trick or treating. So we need to, why, oh, you're having a party, that's why. Oh, another, another tweet. Yet another tweet. How splendid. Why can't, oh, we have to zoom in, don't we? Um, excuse me? Why can we not trick, oh, because I'm clicking on the wrong person. I'm a stupid person, hmm. Trick or treat with Bryce, Jace, um, Maris, Tucker, and Willow. Not Willow. So is that everybody? I think so. Yay, let's go trick-or-treating. Whoop, whoop. That took quite a little bit to set up, but it's good now. Friends, the day we have been patiently waiting for is finally upon us. Spooky day. And spooky day eve. Now, let's go take what's ours. 
Hidden Springs will have no idea what hit him. And that is true. I mean, imagine having, let's see how many kids. One, two, three, four, five kids come at your doorstep and be like, can we have candy? Oh, is this spooky part? Oh, yeah, our feast party's starting. So here's Willis from aware if you've never seen it before. Let's get up here. People should start showing up unless we have a fail party, which I hope we don't have a fail party because that would be depressing. Hmm. Wait, are you guys turning it? Why are you turning into your formal wear? Or your formal wear? Your outer wear. No, don't do that. Did you guys get knocked out? No, whatever. Whatever. And he's like, I don't know why he's in his formal wear. Gosh, guys, really? You went there? You went there. I'm going to change them back into their costumes, then I'll pick back up and have them go trick-or-treating. Because they are sucking right now. <gasps> now it's not letting me trick-or-treat, thank you very much. It's not even an option, so I don't know what is going on. Like, why? But, oh, here we go. Trick-or-treat with... And then the kids, like, please. Some of them aren't in costume, but they refuse to do it. So we're just going to have to work with that. Why did that not work? Why? This is like fail parties tonight. <laughs> what is going on? Uh, stop, 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 stop. Trigger treat with Bryce, Jace, Maris and Tucker. Okay. There we go. Why won't you guys? You're not trick-or-cheating. Trick-or-cheating? What am I talking about anymore? You're not trick-or-treating. I don't know what this glitch is, but I want him to come over here. And now you're trick-or-treating? Now they're trick-or-treating. Okay. I see. Apparently... Tucker doesn't want to go and trick-or-treat. He thinks he's too cool for that, so whatever. He'll just have to stay home, and you are in your wedding dress. Psycho. I swear. Psycho. No, that's okay. I don't really feel like we're going to be doing anything. Stop. Don't play in your wedding dress. <sighs> Can you from more, too? Oh, another Twitter message. Great. Oh, that was my timer. I'm dancing. I'm pausing that. Um, yeah, that was a major fail. Uh, I guess he's the only one trick-or-treating, whatever. I don't know, I don't. Let's buy some cakes, do some aging up, nobody showed up. I can't even believe, why did nobody show up to our party? That is such a fail. Oh gosh, okay. So we need three cakes, one for Lana, one for Chris, and one for Juliet. I can't believe they're going to be elders. They're so old. So old. So let's start. Let's start with Chris. No, we'll start with Juliet. Call everybody to eat the cake. I don't know. I don't understand. Juliet, you're aging up first. Age yourself up. Looks like no one is coming to the party. How sad. I can't- I'm so mad that nobody showed up to our party. Like, I am furious. Ugh. So here we go. She's aging up to an elder. All grown up. Look at their hair, guy. I'm, like, gonna cry. I'm trying not to cry because I don't even know why. I'm so excited. I'm so sad. Juliet is- Juliet's gonna be old. Guys, that's huge. And I know her age got reset again. I don't know when. I think it's from her being pregnant so much, but yeah. Oh, she's an elder. She's adorable. I'll edit her and create a cinnamon a little bit, but I want to say she's adorable. Oh gosh, I'm like gonna cry right now. Honestly, why? Oh, they still want a woohoo. I'm not sure if I'm doing that or not anymore. Can I delete this? Yes, I can. Next person to age up is Chris. So you, you're on your butt on the couch watching TV while your wife age up, ages up. Good job, Chris. You keep getting it. You keep being faithful to your wife. That is an ear toying. Ear toying? Ear toying. That is an ear toying sound. Look how old you are, Juliet. Oh. What? I th how could they be out on the most important night of the year? Lame. I don't think he's getting any candy. Sorry, I don't. Okay, you're aging up now. No response. Next house. Time is candy, people. I don't think you're gonna get me. I'm sorry. Oh, she wants to buy a cane. That is so perfect. We're doing that. 
Um, we're not woohooing woo with him. Just, yeah, no. Come on, age up, age on up, age on up, age up, Chris. And, yeah, he's now an elder, too. He wants to go to China now. Maybe we'll do that. That would be kind of fun to do. I don't know. I'll promise it for now, but I'm not sure if I'm going to do it or not. And delete that. And I like all this boob that... What's her name? Willow is showing. Goodness sakes. Be a little decent. Actually, I shouldn't be talking. I gave her that formal wear. Okay, age up Lana now. You can hold it. You can hold it, boo. He's an elder now. Oh my gosh, so crazy. You're all grown up and adorable. Yay, he's in his little tux. Ugh. Are you? Yeah, you're aging her up. I know you have to pee. I know you do. You might wet your pants or your dress, which is probably not a very womanly, grown-up, lady thing to do, but we're gonna work with it. We are. Here we go. Here's her first birthday. And you really have to go use the bathroom. I don't even think you're gonna make it, but we can try. <laughs> we can try. So let's see this. There's just, like, no emotion. I wish the babies could have more emotions than just, like, nothing. Oh, Lana is a toddler now. How adorable. Okay, I'll go ahead and show you them in Cass. Once my game unfreezes. Hey, cool, my game's frozen. Let's have a conversation. How y'all doing today? Um, pretty good. I've been my game freezing right now. The plum bob is spinning. Oh, there it goes. Okay. Ah, there is... Did I get cut off there? I don't know. And Twitter again. Ah, here is the lovely Twitter. Shush. I'm going to turn off. Sounds really fast. Uh, okay. Anyway, here is the adorable Lana. Her hair is custom content. Her outfit is from the Simsley store. And that's pretty much it. She is cute. Yay. Yeah, she definitely has her mom's skin tone. And she has... Her dad's hair, and she looks kind of Asian already, so I'm excited to see her once she's like a teen and stuff, but yeah, so exciting. Okay, so now I'm going to go ahead and edit Juliet and then Chris, and we can check them out. Check them out. Here is Juliet's new look. I just dyed her hair her old color. Gave her this hairstyle. That's the custom content. I've had it for such a long time. I don't even know where it's from. I changed up her makeup a little bit. Gave her more of a natural lip color. Um, the top comes with the Simpsons Store Country Living set. The skirt is University Life. And the ballet flats are just base game. You know, I think she's pretty cute if I do so so myself. I've said that a million times, but whatever. Nah. On to Chris. Here he is. So... Uh, I don't even remember where this stuff is from. Uh, the jacket, I believe it's from Showtime. The pants are University Life. The shoes are University Life and same hair and everything. So, yeah, Chris, he pretty much looks similar, but I just wanted to give him a little bit of a different style. Something kind of wintry, but not super wintry, you know. Okay, now I have to sell this cake. I just, like, cannot even believe that they are elders. They're all... Grown up, just all grown up. <laughs> I like how we have Jace over here, like an alien. We have the craziest family. I mean, we have nine Sims in this household. We have nine Sims in this household. We have the craziest family you've ever seen. And, you know, you know. So make sure to subscribe. I'll talk to you guys later. Thank you for being awesome. And, yeah. Bye.